at Anderson Marsh State Historic Park. I understand you had a preview tour of the ranch house area just moments ago, which is excellent. So Tuesday we started by heading off to Anderson Marsh and we met up with a group of volunteers, locals, that came out and helped out with the uh, cleanup project. So pretty much we rounded up together and broke off into different teams and then uh, went around through the marsh and did cleanup. And the marsh is an incredible habitat. It's a natural preserve. It's one of the last remaining Thule marshes on Clear Lake. It's, it's a big filter for the lake, a big breeding area for birds and fish. So we sort of have everything. We have the Native American things, we have the European settler things, we have nature, and then we have garbage. <laughs> so, so today, hopefully, we're gonna, you're gonna get a chance to see why we love this area, even as you're walking through and helping to, to pick up things. So a couple of people use shovels along with picks and everything to actually dig out huge trash carts that have been like like grocery grocery carts have been buried there for like years and it was a uh, it was definitely labor intensive but it was it was good fun and like we got a lot of trash a lot of good things done so it was an overall overall success Wednesday we split up and half of us went to an elementary school and the other half went to Rodman Slough. I was fortunate enough to go to the elementary school and there are kids ages um, from kindergarten through middle school there and they were just so sweet, very different from the kids back at home. I think that's a really unique aspect to look into of um, how kids are so different, like a, even in the same state. Uh, we made little bunny puppets and we read stories. We played with Play-Doh. I was with kindergartners and they were so sweet. They would like come up to us and hug us and um, like make us pictures. We uh, went to Robin Slew, me and a couple other students, and we actually helped uh, dig trenches or holes so we can uh, put posts to uh, kind of because around Robin Slough there's a trail and along those trails there's different like plants and everything so to help identify those people that were walking. So I'm Gloria Flaherty the executive director of Lake Family Resource Center and the Marymount crew today is working on our new playground. We did a fundraising drive and banks and Corvette Club and artist groups and the community donated so that we could have a playground for our child abuse treatment program and for our parenting programs. So when the therapists are working with children, oftentimes it's much easier for them to work with kids in a playground setting rather than to try to do talk therapy. So this is for that purpose. And so now this garage will be turned into a community center and classroom, and the playground will be a place for the kids to gather and play during that time as well. This trip kind of just like opened my eyes to how like a small school like Marymount can make such a big difference to a community like this. So when I came out here, I, I actually realized like, all the basic uh, things that like we need in life and how it's really not checking your like the updates on Facebook and stuff it's it's really just uh, like looking around and see like all the amazing people that you're with and it's kind of really really nice to know that you are you are welcome here and wanted so I, I do plan coming back and maybe staying mm -hmm. for a semester and checking this place out even more. Just the community itself that's very welcoming. It's all of you guys. Like before, I really didn't know you guys, but like now with these past few days, I've been like really getting to know you guys one-on-one. -on -one. It's just pretty, pretty rad. Going off of what like everybody said, like coming up here, the community, and how much they want us out here. But also, I think one of the highlights for me was how close we've all come together. Um, I think last night at the dinner, where we were all being filmed and doing our MCU, um, that was so much fun and it just made it like so worth it <coughs> that we're up here all representing the school and it was just really amazing. 